You have to keep going. You just have to do it. You have to keep going. You cannot give up. I mean, I left corporate America to follow my dreams and follow my passions. for scouting talent uh, the last well I would say eight years um, I've just had this great love for unsigned talent Wait to the fans, they coming in. Am I the camera? Albert, where'd you fly in from? I flew in from DC. Ate the blue chips. Uh-huh. Number one airline in the world. The blue chips and animal cookies. Animal. <laughs> <laughs> I'm the chauffeur this year. Albert is the cameraman. So we're gonna work that So out. if it don't come out right, don't blame it on me. <laughs> Alcohol, it's okay. No excuses this year. So Blame it on wet willies. Blame it on wet willies. Cause that's what we're about to go see. So okay. <laughs> Lives are really intertwined, and you, you know, you can be here and they can be there, and you know, you're just running, you know, parallel to each other. We're going to West South Beach. We're going to meet our other friends, B, uh, and her friends from New York. Gorgeous, B. Gorgeous, beautiful, and uh, we're gonna kick it from there. You kind of realize that. It's like, wow, 20 years later, you know, you meet this person like, you were right there, I was right there. So we have arrived at our hotel. We are staying at the fabulous J. Let me just give you a, okay, first of all, all right, let me just give you a scan of the room. This room is ridiculous. Now we stayed at the Epic last year. This, this, this is Epic down. Epic, <laughs> sorry, we love you Epic from a distance, but this look at down. the bed and this is, this is Alvin, look at this. This is great, look at the, te look at the TV. That's a 65-inch flat screen. Screen, Samsung. Samsung. And it's very nice. This is... Wow. That's me. Hey. Look at the bathroom. This is beautiful. This is really, really, really nice. Bathtub. We got TV and um, shower. So I'm just giving you, you know, giving you a little bit of a, a, a you know, just a sampling of, of uh, the type of luxury that, you know, this is a five-star. I think this is considered a six-star hotel. They got to take this up another level. Yeah. And I get my rate here. Right. And you know, oh, okay. What's the regular rate? $369, $400 a night? No, the regular rate? The regular rate. The regular rate is 500 The regular rate in this room is 500 plus. We got this room for $100, uh, 108 per night. Now, isn't that crazy? That's why you have friends that work for the government. <laughs> How you doing? <laughs> All right. <laughs> so people that, that do have dreams and passions and all these things that they want to do, you know, I'm always uh, saying you have to keep going. You just have to do it. You 
have to keep going. You cannot give up. How y'all doing? Hey, 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 say hi. Hey. Y'all enjoy? Y'all had a good weekend? Yes. Yeah, how you had? I would have a better Great. weekend if he did his camera on us. Oh, oh, see? Oh, another one, do another one on celebrity like status. We don't do that now. <laughs> this is just when we go home, we just remember yeah. our time and time. She don't want to be, you know, how that goes. celebrities. Hello. I know that's right. Uh, not celebrities, right. right. What's the story? Anybody on this planet that just wants to be here and not accomplish some type of goal, dream, or passion that they have, this is so Last year, wait, wait, at wait, this wait, time, wait. you wanted to wade in the water, you wanted to steal people's pin numbers and everything, <laughs> and all that stuff, and you wanted to, you know, stop, ride people's skateboards up and down the block, but this year, you want to walk down the block and not say nothing? That's my choice. <laughs> really? Look at Anthony, look at him. He's so fucked up. Oh, he is fucked up. Look at him. That's the Z Ocean Hotel. That's a new hotel. See the two girls at the top of up there kissing? That's them up there. Get them. She got roaches. She got roaches? Z Hotel, don't do it. She got roaches. They had a shooting here. They had a shooting here last night. They had a shooting here last night. Anytime you see yellow tape, you know somebody got killed. This was a shooting last night. Hell no. You can go to the Oh no. She upset about something. Wait a minute. She upset about something. She upset about something. What's going on? I know that's right. I know that's right. Yeah. Columbus, Georgia. Yes. But she's from Columbus, Georgia, so you know what that gives. That's why she's upset. Exactly. Right. It's not even. It's not even ATL. It's not even an ATL. Columbus is like two hours outside of Georgia. They still have clay streets. They still have, yeah. It happens when you get black. See, there's some things that happen when you get a crowd together. You got to have, you know, people mess it up. We mess it up for ourselves. Right, absolutely. So, y'all on YouTube and Twitter, when y'all see this, we mess it up. Twitter. Okay, When you put it on, y'all on Twitter, when we mess it up for ourselves. You know what I'm saying? Right, the city allows us to have functions and we don't know how to act. How to act. So guess what? What happens? They're going to shut it down. My, my dream and my passion is traveling the world. Um, I've, 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 so far, I've got a great start. I've, I've been to Trinidad, to Scout Talent. I've been to uh, Europe. I've been to Puerto Rico. I mean, that's, that's a, a, a small uh, a travel map in the sense of the word, uh, but it's a start. This motherfucker was just in a dead sleep. No, I wasn't. Yeah, well, we got food. Well, we waited online for food for an hour. We waited online at checkers. And there was nobody in front of us. The kids in front of checkers fight and stuff. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, you know what? Just let me get my damn food. Because, you know, I don't like to go to sleep with liquor. Yeah, that's not good. I can't without my food. Yeah, because you don't want to be um, sick. I was like, I don't care. Y'all can fight all day long. Just let me get my hamburger and go to my business. Oh. You know what I'm saying? Like, come on. They chasing each other down the street. Right, they was running, running down the street and everything. I was like, what in the world? And Anthony and I, we... We had drive through line tickets so long. We in the car, knocked out. Sleep. <laughs> and they behind us honking the horn. They, we like, shut us, up. They were behind us honking the horns. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it was funny. It was too funny. I was like, uh, uh this, it, it was too. Funny. So what's on the itinerary? I don't know. What we, look, I don't know what we're gonna do today, but we're gonna figure it out. Yeah. Um. Alvin is not doing well as a cameraman. I think I'm gonna have to fire him, but we're gonna give him one more chance yeah. today. Yeah, we're gonna give him one more chance, and then we're gonna see what we're gonna do. Um, I'm, oh, wow. uh, yeah, hold on. Let me let me get up, y'all, and you know, I'll probably have the camera with me and everything. All right, so All right, exactly. talk to y'all later. I'm out.
that they oh. told can be replaced. Hurricane season starts today, so we're getting up out of here. So if this is any last minute excitement we could catch at the airport. Yes. <laughs> oh yeah, y'all start boarding. How do you feel about going home now? <laughs> you want the real answer? Whatever you feel, man. Uh huh. I'll be home like when you get home. Like our plane lands at like what is it? You know I got. I'm kind of ready yeah. to go back to work. We have an audition tomorrow. Uh huh. Okay. Next, next, next vacation next is Dominican Republic. Dominican Republic. I might have to go to Vegas, but that will be that will be that'll be a page for Oh, yeah. All right. Next stop is Dominican Republic. Exactly. I left corporate America to follow my dreams and follow my passions. You know, no money in the bank. Um, been able to uh, establish a successful showcase. I've done well over 500 shows and so many artists have come across now as we talk specifically music artists so many have come across that stage and you know they've done American Idol they've done The Voice they've done X Factor those are the, the stories that um, I like to see I like to hear when people say hey yo Ed you know I, I did um, I did um, I auditioned for Glee you know, and if, if it wasn't for the opportunity of being on your stage, I wouldn't have been able to do that. My, my dream and my passion, to seek out new talent, find it, you know, um, bring it back here, you know, say, hey, listen, this is, a, this is the, the next big thing. This is the next big star, you know. It doesn't necessarily have to be music. It can be an artist, it can be a fashion designer. So uh, that's, I just want to be that. That's my inner thing, you know, going to these big music festivals and seeing, hey, you know, seeing somebody on stage doing a really, really great song and, you know, being able to uh, bring that person, maybe bring that person, you know, maybe even bringing somebody from the U.S. to U.K., you know, hey, let me be that catalyst to, to connect those dots. Um, yeah, you know, uh, that's what I want to do. I think I may want to be outside. Mm hmm That's tight. This is where it's at. I like the outside. Tonight I'm hosting. So I'm hoping that everything goes smoothly. Didn't really get time to prepare, but
this is going to be interesting because it's a different type of party, it's a different type of atmosphere. I'm a little nervous. I'm a little nervous because I've, you know, I've, I've never done a bow ride, so. <laughs> Drinks are gonna be flowing, people are gonna be eating, there's talent, and it's not like it's the club where you get tired and then you could just leave the club. Basically, once you're on that boat, you on the boat. Num yo ho renge cure. Num yo ho renge cure. Y'all pray for me. Hopefully shit to my soul. You know, have fun with the crowd, interact with the crowd. I like to have a set at as a as a just like the performing artists do. I have a musical set with my DJ that uh, when I come out and and, and, and interact with the crowd, he plays my music. So that's one thing um, I've learned as a host, and I think I do a pretty good job. You're the host, you need to make them feel your energy. It's as simple as that. On the next episode of It's an Ann Jones World. Let's rewind. I want to introduce you to my team and the people that I've worked with. First, there's Lil Nat. That's why I was so mad when that girl came up here. Then, there's Lady Life. You guys photobombed my phone. I got shots left for this. Look at the shots. Shot, 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 shot. Then there's Donovan. Donovan is the one that has always challenged me. But you know what? I appreciate that. Because you know what? You kind of need somebody that can balance. You can't be in charge all the time. Hmm. Wait, wait. We talked. She lost. We, and we exited the club. She had her phone out like, you tell me why we lost! Huh? Oh, hell oh, no! Was like, oh, yes. hell no! This is my first out of town since Trinidad. This is my first trip, first showcase, get to judge some artists and get to speak to some artists and get to do a little bit of talking and things like that. I have a huge roster of hip hop artists. Most of my showcases in New York are, I would say, 65% hip hop artists. I just don't want them all to sound the same. All right, we about to let Ann Jones talk to y'all real quick. So uh, give it up, give it up for my big brother. Don't let this man get you in trouble.